One of the best things about the second trimester is that you pretty much pass the worry of miscarriage. So almost all miscarriages occur in the first trimester. Once you're in the doctor's office and you can hear the baby's heartbeat, you can pretty much know that you're going to have a child. It's very rare to miscarry at that point. So this is a good time that you can tell your family, your friends, you pretty much know that you're going to have a baby. Now there are some rare cases of pregnancy loss in the second trimester. Uh, the most common being just something called cervical incompetence. And that's where the cervix, for some reason, isn't strong enough to hold the baby in once it gets to be a certain size. What happens with that is people tend not to have any contractions. Their cervix just dilates. Uh, and then eventually, at the very end, maybe there'll be a, your water will break or you'll start having contractions and deliver the baby. I mean, that's a terrible thing because babies at that age, in the second trimester, uh, really can't survive. Things to watch for for cervical incompetence would be if all of a sudden you have a big discharge that you're not used to having um, or you feel a lot of pressure. That would be a reason to call your doctor and be checked out. There is a procedure that can be done called a cerclage where basically if this is a cervix, we take a suture and we suture it around the cervix and then tie it shut like a purse string and that closes up the cervix and helps hold things in if the cervix isn't strong enough. So it gives the cervix more strength. Unfortunately, that doesn't work once the cervix is already dilated. So we usually don't figure that out the first time somebody loses a pregnancy from cervical incompetence, but it's a treatment we can do with subsequent pregnancies, usually at about 14 weeks. So if you're gonna have a cerclage, this procedure because of previous pregnancy loss in the second trimester, that's generally done at about 14 weeks. But don't let me scare you because that's very rare. And once you get into that second trimester and the baby's heart is beating, you're in good shape and it's extremely unlikely you're gonna lose that pregnancy. Uh, so that is actually one of the best things about hitting the second trimester. MedTwice.com